Welcome everybody to this lesson that's talking about the different types of roundabouts. In this lesson, we are going to look at the different types of roundabouts and how they can be applied. As you know, there are seven types of roundabouts. Now what normally separates these seven types of roundabouts is the inscribed diameter and also the different physical layout. The inscribed diameter is the distance of the inscribed circle, which is the outer cup of the circulatory lane. Now, if you look at this roundabout, this is the inscribed circle for the outer cab. And the distance, which is the diameter of this inscribed circle, is the inscribed diameter. Now, there are seven roundabouts that we are going to look at and talk about in the next few videos. And these are, first is the mini roundabout. These are small roundabouts which are normally 25 meters in inscribed diameter. The second is the compact roundabout. This ranges between 25 meters and 35 meters in inscribed diameter. Number three is the normal roundabouts, which are normally 30 meters in inscribed diameter. Then four, we have the turbo roundabouts, which is a modification of the normal roundabout. We have the double roundabouts, which as the term says, these are just two roundabouts that are joined by a short link. We have signalized roundabouts, which normally are called access controlled roundabouts. And then finally, we have the grid separated roundabouts, which is just a roundabout with different levels of access below or above. Now, in the next lesson, we are going to look at each of these types of roundabouts and how they can be applied in detail. So stay tuned and I hope to see you in the next lesson.